Hello everyone, my name is Liang Zhao. I'm a senior product specialist in the molecular spectroscopy group at Shimazu Scientific Instruments. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the auto sampler for sample quantitation on a UV VIS spectrophotometer. First, install a sipper in the sample compartment of a UV VIS spectrophotometer. A sipper is needed to withdraw samples from standard and unknown sample vials. Two types of sippers are offered by Shimazu, one with a peristaltic pump and the other with a syringe pump. In this demonstration, sipper 160L with a peristaltic pump is used. Please refer to the user manual for details of installation. Shimazu offers the SeaTac ASX280 or 560 auto samplers for its UV Viz spectrophotometers. Please refer to the instruction manuals of the auto samplers for the correct methods of mounting the Z drive, connecting the rinse station, assembling the sample vial racks, connecting the tubes, and connecting to the host computer. After installing the auto sampler, place the standard and unknown samples in desired places on the sample rack and switch the power on. In this demonstration, three standard samples in large sample vials are placed in positions S2 to S4. One unknown sample is placed in position 4A. Launch the Lab Solutions UV Viz software. Click the Quantitation tab to start the Quantitation module. Inside the Quantitation module, click Instrument Control. Then click Edit in the pop-up window to set up a parameter file for quantitation. Register the measurement wavelength. Set instrument parameters and don't forget to select the appropriate sipper in the accessory setting and set parameters for sipper operation. Save the parameter file. Click Connect to establish communication with the spectrophotometer and close the instrument control pop-up window. Click Instrument and select Automatic Control. A small pop-up window will appear. From the Lab Solutions UV Viz Launchpad, Click Automatic Analysis to launch the optional Automatic Analysis module. To set the parameter file for the auto sampler, click Edit. Select Quantitation for measurement mode, then select the correct auto sampler model. Then click Next. In the Setup window, enter sample information. In the Sample Type section, select Standard then assign vials S2 to S4 as standard samples. Select a cleaning mode and indicate if baseline measurement is to be performed. Click Add to Table. The standard sample information will populate the lower section of the window. Enter the concentration of the standard samples one by one. Go back to the Sample Type section and select Sample, then assign vial 4A as Unknown Sample. Click Add to Table. The unknown sample information will be added to the sample table. The Auto Quantitation module enables you to set up to four independent quantitation analyses. In this demonstration, Analysis 1 is used. Under the Analysis 1 tab, enter file name, analyst name, and select the quantitation parameter file saved previously. Click Save As and Close to save the parameter file. In the Automatic Analysis module, click Connect to establish communication with the auto sampler. The Start button will turn green if the connection is successful. Click the Start button. The spectrophotometer and the auto sampler will carry out quantitation measurement according to the settings. In the Quantitation module, measurement results will show up in the Standard table and the Unknown Sample table. A calibration curve will be displayed on the right. For more information on Shimazu auto samplers or UV Viz instruments, please visit us at www.ssi.shimazu.com. Excellence in Science, Shimazu.